Marsh, that's intended for Mark Walters. And Stewart's raced into the far post. The keeper thought about coming, and that was so close to being an own goal. Jonathan Gould started to come and changed his mind when he realised the defender would get it. And as it was turned round for the corner, it was so close to going in by the foot of the post. Mike Marsh takes it short. Redknapp gives it him back. This is the Norwegian international. That's a good ball to pick out Walters. Oh, the keeper and the defender not on the same wavelength. Redknapp, that's dipping wickedly. Early tests for the son of the manager, Bobby Gould. Hurst, all space there for Rosario to get forward. Confronted by Mark Wright. Here's Lee Hurst up from the back. Oh, it looked like a push on Hurst. Yes, and a handball, penalty given. Jamie Redknapp's hand certainly came into contact with the ball as he fell, but Liverpool may feel that's just a little bit harsh. Penalty given. Brian Burrows will take this penalty, and he puts Coventry one up. Seven minutes before half time. And that very much against the run of play. Mick Quinn. Still Mick Quinn, and he got his shot in. But the whistle had already gone for a handball against the Coventry player. Oh, well, in fact, he's given handball against the Liverpool player. Referee's decision takes uh, most people in this stadium by surprise. Anyway, it's given Coventry this free kick, which is teed up for Brian Burrows to hit. Brilliant strike by Burrows. 2-0 Coventry. Well, whatever went on before, you couldn't argue with the strike by Brian Burrows. He scored the first from the penalty spot and an absolute blistering shot then for goal number two. Still Barnes gets in another great cross and this time Young Gould touches it over for a corner. Again, Liverpool have plenty of players to look for. This is Bjorn B. Oh, it wasn't a bad strike, was it? Not a lot of backlift. Rosario. Gallagher will get to this. He can run in. Is this three for Coventry? It is. Liverpool caught right through the middle. Kevin Gallagher's fourth of the season. Coventry's third of the match. Well, Liverpool have got to find a way back in this match pretty quickly. Trailing here by three goals to nil. Oh, fabulous strike by Jamie Redknapp. His third of the season. And he struck that magnificently. It was inch perfect, right into the top corner. Now giving Gallagher. Oh, obstruction by Jamie Redknapp, and he could be in trouble, Jamie Redknapp. Now, how will Kelvin Morton deal with this? He's reaching for the top pocket, and Jamie Redknapp is looking at the floor because he knows it's two cards, red and yellow, shown the yellow card in the first half. And for a second, cautionable offence, a really blatant obstruction, having just given Liverpool one goal on their fight back to send off Kevin Gallagher. Oh, good footwork. Now Rosario, Coventry are beginning to flow. Kenny Sampson's gone on the overlap. Here he is, the former England player. And that's a good cross as well. Fabulous goal, Mick Quinn continues that astonishing scoring record since he came here initially on loan from Newcastle but having confirmed his full-time transfer this week is absolutely delighted and what a scoring record seven goals in this is his fifth game Lloyd McGrath got there ahead of Stewart Rosario Quinn over the top for John Williams 
whose pace is at times really embarrassed Liverpool. That's over the top of the keeper. Rosario's header. Quinn gets another. It's five for Coventry. And this is turning into a real rout. Quinn second. Coventry's fifth. And poor Mike Hooper borrows. Oh, a little flick there by Rosario. This is John Williams. Twisting and turning and into space. And he's got it right across to Kevin Gallagher, who's missed. And then Quinn didn't quite get on the ball across the face of goal. And it should really have been six.